a lot of uh, fake uh, diamonds out there. They're still diamond, but they're like fake because one is man-made diamond. There's a lot of these diamonds in the marketplace. If you guys are not familiar, you can go on Google and uh, look it up how it's made. So next one is uh, uh, there, there are uh, diamonds where when you take the, the whole diamond and then turn it upside down, you're going to see like laser drilled and then took out all the black and dirt, all those things from the holes out. Uh, <clears throat> and those diamonds, they look very nice and clean. But like from the face, you don't see the holes. From the side and the back, you guys can, can see the laser drilled and uh, cleaned. And those diamonds are pretty much used to be very dirty, not good diamonds. So watch out for that. <clears throat> the next one is this one other method they do is they fill up jail inside those uh, uh, through those small uh, cracks, the, the laser holes. And... Uh, so now when you turn you don't see the holes anymore because it's hidden and the diamond actually gets even more spark because of those gel and One way to see this is like when you spin the diamond upside down You're gonna see rainbow colors and then watch out for that rainbow color because A real diamond does not have rainbow color in it. It, it doesn't shine rainbow. It, it has really sharp blue and pink and uh, yellow colors in it uh, which the light reflects through it right so so watch watch out for those things one other thing you want to make sure uh, the diamond has a certificate and the cert certificate is very important the two really good certifications uh, exist out there for center stone diamonds so when you when you uh, buy something you don't uh, lose any money uh, your investment is solid which is uh, one of the uh, number one certificate is GIA to to make sure that you look for GIA those are the best certificates they're graded 100% and then the next one is EGL EGL is graded 90% so these are two different companies. They grade differently. <clears throat> if if the diamond is uh, is is G color and then uh, was uh, was let's say uh, uh, GIA G color and then uh, EGL could be H color, which is uh, one grade down. This is how they grade uh, these stones. So make sure uh, if, if someone tells you this is cheaper, this is more, this is what's going on, this is uh, what to look for. Look for uh, the other kind of diamonds so you don't lose any money. Sometimes uh, you shouldn't be shy or, sh or, or, or afraid to ask for diamond tester. So all the jewelry shops, they, have, they should have diamond tester. And then what, what you want to do is like when you're buying diamond, you want to ask them diamond tester and then put the tester to the diamond, even those tiny small diamonds on the ring. Because a lot of the times what happens is they use a lot of monzonite and then monzonite, it looks like diamond, but it's not diamond. But those testers can tell you if they are a real diamond or not. So you make sure you, you ask for the tester and then check your diamonds if they're diamond or not. If they are, then at least you know that you're buying diamond.